In this video, Dynas South Africa's pre-sales solution manager Shanawas is going to walk us through their commercial and industrial all-in-one energy storage inverter system, the DH200F. Good morning everyone, welcome to Solar Europe. My name is Shanawas, I'm part of the Dynas SA pre-sales team. Today I'm going to introduce to you our DH200F, which is an all-in-one system. Would you please come through with me? Let me show you the unit. So as you can see here, this is our DH200F, our all-in-one system. This comprises of an inverter with a battery storage. On the outside here, we have a quick indicator light system that can give you the overall status if we are in the run or in the fault state, or if we need to emergency power off the unit, we can do so. Next up, I'm going to take you through inside the unit. And here we have 15 batteries of 14 kilowatts each with one BDU system. On my right hand side here, on the top we have two MPPTs with one PCS based inverter, an SDS switch with an, an EMS controller, as well as your circuit breakers for your various components and your MPPT control switches. Below that we have the circuit breakers for load and grid. Next up we have is the human interface screen. This can control the system. And on the other door here we have is the aircon unit. This is an industrial size aircon to ensure that the unit is at optimal temperature all the time. Please come with me through the back. I want to show you the connections. So here at the back of the unit, as you can see, we have our bus bus, we have our battery connections, and we have everything pre-configured into the PCS. Below, we have our UPS and our circuit breaker switches. These units are all pre-configured like this, so it makes it easier to install. Installer only he has to do is connect his grid and load connections, and the unit is ready to commission. This is an all-in-one system compromising of a 100 kilowatt PCS based inverter with a 215 kilowatt battery storage. Join our WhatsApp community to gain access to the Dynas Tech Support Group by scanning the QR code or via the link in the description below.